people are bullied every day, constantly. Racial slurs being said. This bullying happens in front of teachers, authorities. To be cool, you have to pick on the little guys. You know, words can really take a lot out of a person. I think bullying is a really big problem and people don't really see how affected others get by it. There's people who sit there and they'll like call names and then there's uh, physical ones as well. Like you can be walking down the hallway and all of a sudden you'll see a guy get shoved into a locker. I've seen like fights break out, racial slurs being said. Yeah, I've seen a lot of it on Facebook. Facebook definitely because I think people just, they hide behind their computers and their keyboards. Kids feel like because it's online they'll never get in trouble. Pretty much just a lot of drama, a lot of like backstabbing. I noticed that there's a lot of talking down to and uh, you know publicly humiliating another student. It really is just about making the other person feel horrible and unsure of themselves. I personally know people that have self-harmed and thought about suicide. It can go far. It can even go to people taking their own lives. And I, I guess they just like that, that little sort of high from making fun of another person. They find enjoyment in it. It like comes from like just hating somebody from like the way they dress and like the way that they talk and things like that. Just petty things that people find to pick at people for. I think it's just mainly because they're different or they have something that they can be made fun of, like a speech problem, a mental disability, like their different race, their orientation. Most of the time it's because like the bully's twice the kid's size and he, he knows he's going to be an easier target. I also know sometimes someone is just mean and they just do it because that's who they are and that's how they make themselves feel better or how they make their identity. I think they get satisfaction um, by trying to hurt somebody. People just, they try to fit in and they do anything to try to be accepted in a group. You know, if you know, a bunch of guys are with their friends, they see some outcast or somebody like that, they poke fun at them. It's really, I think it's really a way of showing one's dominance over another person. I feel like uh, if someone won't speak up for themselves, you have to help them. You know, if if there's a group picking on some kid, I, I you know I try to stick up for that kid. Yeah, you got to stop it. Because otherwise, it's just going to get worse for that person. We won't be able to preemptively stop bullying, but we can convince people on the sidelines to help. And I think that's really important that everybody shouldn't be afraid or scared of intervening because you really are might actually help save some kid. But now I would say that a majority of the people that see someone getting bullied will step in and you know say, that's not cool, you're not being cool in front of anyone. Um, I just feel like the bullying is just a way like to put down people and like it should like stop. As people mature, they realize that you know everyone's a person. I feel like people just need to be more accepting and being different doesn't make them, you know, victim. I know a lot of teachers are really in tune with this, especially with all the bullying against, you know, like um, being gay or like gender identity. Our teachers are really good at fighting stuff like that. And I think, um, especially with all the stuff that's happened, more teachers are now trying to pay attention a little more. Because if there were more people who would step in, I think that might make a lot of people feel better and maybe eventually, um, bullying would slowly dissipate. It's really tough to do the right thing in front of people who are making bad choices, but we really, really need you. When people are kind of asking for help, we all need to stick together. The important thing to know is there's resources out there for you. You are not alone. I know our administrators have done a really nice job being proactive at putting a stop to bullying. We also have the Gay Straight Alliance, which is a club that works to promote the acceptance of um, who people are as individuals. If anybody witnesses and or is a victim of bullying, uh, 
Um, there's over 200 plus staff members in this building. They can come to any adult at any time. It doesn't just have to be a teacher, it can be anybody. Um, no one will report their name throughout the investigation and it'll be dealt with. So we encourage anybody who's a witness and or a victim of bullying to please step forward and report it. Guys, please feel free to come to me. Or you can come to me. Or me. Or you can come to me. Or me. You can come to me. You can come to me.